trace the incorrect features with respect to lenticels. So what are lenticels? Lenticels are lens shaped opening in extracellular region. This is correct. They are meant for exchange of gases between the plant's interior and the external environment. This is true. They do not possess a regulated opening and closing like stomata. This is very true. Lenticels consist of dead parenchymatous cells. Parenchymatous cells are not dead, they are living. So lenticels consist of living parenchymatous cells with large intercellular spaces? No, with no intercellular spaces. So this option is ruled out. So we have to trace the incorrect feature with respect to lenticels. So that means option number four is the correct answer for this question. Moving on to the next question, that is question number 132. Which of the following is not observed in angiospermic trees growing in temperate regions? Temperate region mein temperature kaisa hota hai? Temperate region mein temperature or weather condition varies. Temperature changes and weather condition also changes with time. Heartwood, sapwood, early wood, diffuse forest wood. In which concy wood is not observed in angiospermic trees growing in temperate regions. Heartwood is observed, sapwood is observed, early wood is also called as spring wood. It is also observed in the angiospermic trees growing in temperate regions. Diffuse porous wood. See, we know that angiosperms have vessels. So we say that that angiosperm ki wood is porous. So angiosperms have porous wood. So porous wood could be diffuse porous wood or ring porous wood. Vessels are same diameter ki hai. Vessels are of same diameter. Same diameter. And in case of ring porous wood, vessels are of different diameter. In case of diffuse porous wood, cannot distinguish between summer wood and autumn wood. Summer wood and autumn wood cannot be distinguished. But in case of ring porous wood, they can be distinguished okay uh, diffuse porous wood are not observed in angiospermic trees growing in temperate regions because diffuse porous wood mein vessels are of same diameter Matlab, as diffuse porous wood un conditions mein pahe jati hai jaha pe temperature remains same so in that case vessels be same size ki hoti hai same diameter ki hoti hai aur maha par autumn wood aur spring wood now differentiate nahi kar sakte Okay, so in case of temperate regions, jaha temperature change hota hai, vessels are of different diameter, you can distinguish between summer and autumn wood and in temperate regions, ring porous wood is found. So diffuse porous wood is not found in angiospermic trees growing in temperate regions. So answer to this question is option number Four. Moving on to the next question, that is question number 133. Question number 133 says, identify the incorrect statement regarding bark. Bark includes periderm and secondary phloem. This is true. Bark is contributed by the activity of vascular cambium ring also. This is correct. Bark is formed early in the season and it is called as soft bark. This is true. 
bath is not contributed by phalogen at all no phalogen is the coccambium phalogen is the coccambium and coccambium contributes in the formation of bath so the incorrect statement regarding bath is option number 4 that phalogen is not contributed at all in the formation of bath so answer to this question is option number 4 moving on to the next question that is question number 134 question number 134 says in a trunk of dicot trees after 10 years of secondary growth which of the following will be observable functional primary xylem in the center no in the center heartwood is present so this option is ruled out heartwood is surrounded by ring of sapwood this is correct equal number of layers of secondary xylem and secondary phloem no secondary xylem are more in number more in number as compared to secondary phloem so this is incorrect a functional primary cortex no functional primary cortex is replaced by secondary cortex it is replaced by secondary cortex so in a trunk of dicot tree after 10 years of secondary growth heartwood is surrounded by ring of sapwood so answer to this question is option number 2 moving on to the next question that is question number 135 question number 135 says youngest layer of secondary xylem added by cambium ring lies just towards inner side of vascular cambium ring true it remains more or less intact in or around the center no it consists of balloon like structures called tyloses no xylem parenchyma which lies just adjacent to the xylem vessel form balloon like structure called tyloses tyloses are found in heartwood so this is an incorrect option youngest layer of secondary xylem added by cambium ring is resistant to termites due to deposition of extractives no this statement is also true for heartwood so option number 1 is correct that youngest layer of secondary xylem added by cambium ring lies just towards the inner side of the vascular cambium ring ye aapka vascular bundle hai isme jo cambium ring ye cambium ring hai this is primary xylem this is primary phloem ab jab secondary growth start hogi to secondary xylem will be formed in this side and secondary phloem will be formed towards this side okay to youngest layer of secondary xylem added by cambium ring lies just towards the inner side of the vascular ring inner side of the vascular ring this red color is the vascular ring so inner side of vascular ring me youngest layer of secondary xylem is found so answer to this question is option number 1 i hope you have understood this was all for today thank you